Hey YouTube, it's Marcus here. So today I will be doing my first playthrough on Tower of Fantasy. So yeah, I'm gonna start now. Okay. Hycros has sent someone into the quarantine zone. It's time to release the house. Target signal lost. I can't locate it anymore. Careful. Something about this place doesn't feel right. Hopefully this game is interesting. I do see it being interesting so far. So that's good. Ugh, today's definitely not my day. A mine? This wasn't mentioned in the intel. Energy reserves are low. Please don't fail me now. No! Those monsters are in here!
on, just a little longer. The suppressor. Energy. Just a little more. A little... Target acquired. Understood. Take them away, and wipe their memory. Oh. Okay, <laughs> that's not good. Jake, their heart rate is stable. The worst is over. Now comes the road to recovery. Good thing we got there in time. Hmm? Was that movement? Uh, light? What happened? Hey, can you see me? Zeke, come here! Are you awake? Suppressor seems to be fine. No need to worry. Your suppressor has been replaced with a new energy cell. Feeling better? Much better. And you are? You've been out for a whole day. I thought you were. That's Shirley, and I'm Zeke, her brother. I'm in charge of this shelter. You saved me? Of course. We found you passed out behind the shelter and... Your suppressor was out of power, so we brought you in and fixed it. This is Astra Shelter, area code HT501. What's your name? And what are you doing all alone in the mountains? I... I don't know. I can't remember. This person was all bruised up and passed out in the mountain. Probably a lost scavenger. My character has a nice voice, actually. A lost scavenger? Well, tough luck. The Aberrants built a nest in the Machine Cemetery. You're lucky we found you alive. You can stay here until you recover your memories. We did a full scan of your body and everything seems to be in the clear. I... thank you. Go get yourself cleaned up. You look like a mess. Wow. The Okay, that's not very nice to say, but okay, I look perfect. Thank you very much. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Shirley, go show the newcomer to Celine. I've already informed her. Got it. Hey, newbie, this way. Oh, and your weapon is on top of that crate. Don't forget to pick it up. You look a mess, but at least save your life. Not too shabby, am I right? Did both you and Zeke grow up here? We have been living here since we were very little. There weren't a lot of people back then. Everyone chipped in to build this place little by little. Hmm? Zeke found her in one of the ruins, but its language model is a little buggy. 
So it talks funny sometimes. I apologize. I will do my best to make my speech intelligible. Oh, you're fine, Mia. C come with me, please. We should not keep Miss Celine waiting. Battleship up ahead? That's the Bethlehem. My brother said it's been here for 50 years. Okay, why does it keep showing this? 50 years? Wait, yeah, when the cataclysm took place, an Omnium explosion destroyed an entire fleet that was patrolling nearby. Hey, that's Celine. Let's head on over. You're the one they rescued from outside? Hello, I am here to... You don't seem to be older than Shirley. The outside world must not have been kind to you. Celine, let's help our newcomer get settled in. Yes, yes. my character I see. Series, series, series. Thank you. 
kind of want her eyebrows to show. What do you guys think? Should I make some changes or I don't know? You guys let me know in the comments. Nothing like some brand new clothes, am I right? Thanks for your help. Anyway, now that's done. You can really show the newcomer around the shelter. See if anything needs help. Leave it to me. I think she likes you. Control room. You can monitor every nook and cranny of the shelter here. Morning, Shirley. Morning, Uncle Paul. Is this the one you rescued? How are we feeling today? Much better. Thanks. Staying alive is all that matters in times like these. Consider yourself lucky. Ugh, Uncle Paul, is that alcohol I'm smelling? Ugh. No, alcohol. Uh, <laughs> I might have had a drink or two last night. Oh, I was just going to retrieve the environmental monitoring data. The man had some alcohol last night. <laughs> okay. You're still hungover, aren't you, Uncle Paul? <sighs> Fine, I'll do it. Wouldn't want you to fall into the water again like last time. I'm detecting some very powerful interferences. These guys came prepared. Huh? You want to do it? That's great. Take the chance to look around the shelter, and you won't get lost with the drone guiding you. Done? Let's head on back then. Collecting geological samples. That's enough data samples. Good work.
Good job. I'll take the data to Alfred. Anyway, it's all thanks to your help today. Analysis. Long-term consumption of alcohol is hazardous to physical health. Please follow your dietary recommendations. Reduce alcohol consumption and exercise regularly. True. Mm-hmm. You said it, Mia. Uncle Paul, you'd be smart to listen. I... all right. All right, moving on. I'll take you to meet Fenny. Fenny! Shirley, what brings you here today? Got someone to introduce to you. Hello. Oh, I heard about you. How are you feeling? Zeke replaced the cells in the suppressor. Nothing to worry about. Oh, I almost forgot. This is Fenny. She's like my big sister, but she's only older than me by two days. She's the best chef around. You must try her food. I can cook you anything you want. As soon as the space rift is fixed, then I can get fresh ingredients. Fix the space rift? No biggie. We can do that. Let's go. Uh, about the space rift, it's best if my brother doesn't find out, okay? Log, records show that the shelter had eight accidents this month, and Shirley was responsible for... So, this is our space rift. Um, I don't actually know. Uncle Paul says it uses Omnium to break things down for transmission, and reassemble them at the other end. Huh? So am I still me if I was broken down and reassembled? I... well, um, I, I used it a couple of times, and I still feel like me. So how are we going to fix it? The energy conversion filter's broken. That's all. We can just replace it. That simple? That's simple. Uncle Paul taught me. Could you help me grab the new filter over there, please? I'll check on the operating program. The backup filter is in the little building over there. Do you see it? Just install the filter, and we're done. Will you help me push the filter in? I think something might be stuck. Got it! Easy as pie! Now we just need to test it to make sure it's working fine. Test? On what? On us, of course. But you can only travel from a space rift to another space rift that you've activated. Seeing that you only have access to one space rift, leave the testing to me. I'm not sure that's such a good idea. Don't worry, I'll be fine. Be right back.
Whoa, why, where's my weapon? Why are you... Shirley. Phew. Are you hurt? Log, there have been a total of nine incidents this month in the shelter. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm really scared of bugs. How did you run into it? There's something wrong with the Space Rift's locating system. I was transported to Banja's beach, and that's where I saw them. The locating system's infrastructure is really high-tech. I don't think even Uncle Paul can figure it out. Perhaps we can ask Fra <gasps> Franz for help. Oh, yeah! Why didn't I think of that? Franz from Hykros. He's super smart. Come on, let's go find him. Warning. Space Rift malfunctioned. Normal operation suspended. Mia should stay here to warn others. Good point, Mia. I'll leave it to you then. Careful. Don't let my brother know that we're sneaking out. Is the person you're looking for just outside of the shelter? See that huge boulder over there? The one on the other side of the Blue River. Yes, I see it. But it looks like some sort of... projection? Zeke said it's the entrance to a facility from the old Federation days. They have a Soleocrum system set up to disguise it as a boulder. What's in there? I don't know. Zeke doesn't allow me to get close to it. He says it's dangerous. I bet there's something super important in there. Hykro specially sent Franz here just to investigate it. Get ready. We need to get to the other side of the river. It's still quite dangerous outside, so we must be careful not to get separated. Surely, it's unlike Zeke to let you come this far out. Zeke's busy, so here I am. We need a favor. There's something wrong with the Space Rift's locating system, and you're the only one who knows how to fix it around here. Oh, no problem. I'll take a look on the way back. We were sort of thinking if you could help us maybe... now? We're kinda in a hurry. Well... But I'm trying to fix this deconstructor. Deconstructor? Is that the thing that can eliminate the simulacrum system? That's right. However, this antique stopped working just when I needed it. Will it be difficult to fix? It's just a short circuit. But some of the internal components burned out. It'll probably take me some time. But Fanny is trying to get to Banja's. We're running out of food in the shelter. <sighs> Fine. I'll go fix the spacecraft and come back to this later. Stay here, and don't cause any trouble, okay? Don't worry, you know me. Hmm... I may have a way to get this machine working again. Surely, you're not suggesting... You want to know what's inside too, don't you? If we get this deconstructor working, we can take a peek. 
This deconstructor is an old model manufactured by Banjus Tech. It's not too complicated, so I think I can fix it. From the looks of it, I think the power source probably burned out. So what should we do? Let's head to the Astra Omnium Tower. There's a scrapper there. We can ask if we can borrow its backup power source. We're good friends, so it'll definitely help us. But hey, it's dangerous to be away from the shelter, and it's quite a journey there. Here, take this jetpack to go faster. It'll also help us get out of sticky situations quickly, but you need to be careful when using it. Use the jetpack to fly over difficult terrain. Give it a shot. Omnium Tower, but the surrounding area belongs to the hyenas. Be careful. Omnium Tower. Is the droid up on the Omnium Tower? Well, when I came here with Uncle Palu, we took the elevator and I almost fell off. Did Palu bring you here? Hmm. But after that, my brother wouldn't let me follow him anymore. Hmm. <laughs> Uncle Palu definitely told on me. What did Palu come here for? Does this tower have some special use? To recharge the Omnium energy cells, duh! Many facilities in the shelter rely on Omnium to operate, but the amount we manage to collect on our own is not even close to sufficient. That's why Uncle Palu has to regularly go to the tower to recharge those depleted energy cells. Ah, uh, if only the Omnium from there could somehow be sent directly to the shelter. What does the scrapper you mentioned do? Has it always been on the tower? Of course. I mean, it's the overseer of this Omnium Tower. The Omnium stored here can't be accessed by just anyone, as Hypros has strict rules for that. Each time Uncle Palu comes by, he can only fetch as much as the fixed quota that he's been given. Come on, I'll bring you to meet the droid.
think this playthrough has been long enough. Um, I want to end my playthrough here, guys. I'll be doing my second part of my playthrough sometime soon. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please do drop a like, please subscribe.